Hello Virgo and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of January 18th through the 24th and this is a very general reading. Virgo, it's like coming to a head of something. It's like either um, this could be dealing with um, competitive, uh, it's competitive energy. Something's coming to a head here. Uh, butting heads with someone. So I'm seeing that energy. Now, I do see very quick changes. Okay, very quick changes. Um, I do see something may have made you angry, but I do see sudden changes. Um, uh, breakthroughs for some. For others, this is a very quick change. This could be a sudden move, sudden um, change. I do see that. For some of you, this is like if you've been thinking negatively, all of a sudden you're thinking a lot more positive. So it's like, um, a, ch a change of energy too. So hmm, very interesting. There is a sense of something is colliding. So I would really pick and choose um, my battles this week, pick and choose what path you're on, who you interact with. Um, so thinking things out carefully um, and slowing it down then because I see a, like almost like a collision, like heads coming together or whatever, however. Okay. All right. For some of you, there is one, two, three new beginnings. Um, this is three new ideas, the three new beginnings. I do see that, but you may be doubting something. Or you have three ideas or plan A, B, C. Um, there is some growth or there should be some money coming in. Um, I am seeing that kind of energy. It's like somebody putting a lot of energy into home. Maybe you're wanting to move um, or something in the home dynamics. Okay, so I'm seeing that energy. I do see some good news will be coming through, though. Um, matters of the heart is showing up too. This is maybe something new and by surprise and it's like flirtatious type of energy. Um, I do see that too. It maybe catches you off guard, but I just don't see anything more. So, um, I do see something official. Some of you may be making some verbal agreements or you could be signing something. This could be a, um, a contract or it can be dealing with, uh, legalities. Uh, I do see that there is some kind of, um, jealousy around it's surrounding you there could be some anger too um this could be something that's been seething okay and it's like just it just goes pfft. it's passive aggressive type of energy too maybe it's something you've been holding and holding and holding in okay um i do see that i see this is a week where you will be um uh, there's going to be some sudden endings okay um new opportunities are there they're presenting themselves okay so look for them they are there but you definitely have sudden changes. Quick, quick, quick um, sudden changes. Um, new financial beginning for some of you. I do see that. This is like an offer or something like that. For some of you, this could be a money-making idea. So that is looking good as well. Um, this is maybe you've started a business or something on the side. It's like a side hustle or something. And it's in the beginning stages. So patience is required. Um, I do see some of you are just feeling stuck and trapped in, um, this is your own mind. Um, you're not really stuck. It's like, um, something you want more than what you have, I want to say, okay? Um, or you're worried about oh, other people are going to say. I do see luck is on your side somehow too, if you do kind of take that overthinking cap off, okay? So I do see that messages are going to be important this week. Um, uh, check your emails. Messages are very important. I do see that this is um a lot of energy here. Someone may invite you on a trip or to travel. Um, there is something like that. Uh, for some of you, this is like <laughs> social media dating, long distance dating, but it's really nice communications coming through too. Now, the only thing I see here is there is challenges around you. Um, this can be a known enemy or somebody, um, a formidable en enemy, or it's competitive energy. There can be some drama. There are some changes. Maybe you're just doing a lot of things, too. For some of you, this is multitasking, trying to get some stuff done. But I would pick and choose my battles, okay? Because if you um, confront someone... Or you go after an enemy or you try to do something. Uh, they're going to call your bluff, okay? And it's going to come to not the nicest ending, okay? Um, they may have a win over you somehow or you know what I mean? So I would definitely pick and choose your battles this week. 
For some of you, this is just internal challenges. You're just going, you got some challenges ahead of you. Um, but, you know, don't focus on the negative. It's like focusing on pain from the past or something that someone's hurt you or um, something like that. I do see some sudden, sudden endings, okay? Um, it's bittersweet or it's a bitter ending. So I would pick and choose what challenges you take on. Um, there is a competitive energy. You may not, you know, I would be, I wouldn't take on my enemies this, at this point. Let's put it that way. That's one thing I'm seeing here, there. It's not the best energy for that. Um, but I do see there is an ending here. Um, you know, from, it's the end of some kind of negative situation. Things are going to turn around. There's a turnaround of energy. Um, very quick changes this week. Okay. Um, like I said, pick and choose your battles and your challenges this week. All right. Um, sometimes it's best just to walk away or just leave things be. Okay. Cause, um, you don't want to wind up getting hurt. Now, this to me can also indicate if this is like physical um, competition or something. Be careful. You you could be accident prone. You could like um, hurt yourself. So be careful of that. And if you are like moving things around, um, carrying heavy things, there is something here that warns about uh, be careful. You could hurt yourself. Accident prone. Uh, for some of you too, watch your health and well being because this is like um um maybe get you know getting sick, uh, get catching the flu. So be careful of that energy too. I do see a little bit of a bittersweet ending or something comes to a sudden end too. This will be for some of you just the end of a challenging period, and then you're kind of starting over again, restart, refresh. But sudden quick changes, I do see quick changes in all kinds of energy, uh, this week as well. Okay. All right, Virgo, that was your reading for the week of um, January 18th through the 24th. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I will catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.